President Donald Trump asserted that Mexico was ranked the second deadliest country in the world on Thursday evening and cited drug trade as the cause. When homicide numbers are compared on a per capita basis, Mexico's number of homicides per 100,000 people puts it on somewhat different ground, pushing it to the middle of the pack in Latin America. The Mexican government was previously critical of the report, saying violence related to organized crime is a regional phenomenon that goes beyond Mexico's borders. President Donald Trump on Thursday evening tweeted that Mexico was just ranked the second deadliest country in the world after only Syria. Drug trade is largely the cause. We will build the wall. Trump was likely referring to a recent study by the London-based International Institute for Strategic Studies that named Mexico the second deadliest conflict zone in the world behind Syria and ahead of Iraq. The president retweeted a link to a CNN story about the report when it came out in early May. However, that study was highly disputed and a number of factors undercut the assertion. It should also be noted that a wall would not stop much of the drug flow into the U.S. and that drug-related violence in Mexico has largely not spilled over into the U.S. According to the IAS report, Mexico's nearly 23,000 intentional homicide victims in 2016 fell short of the 50,000 seen in Syria and exceeded the 17,000 recorded in Iraq.